What is up everybody, Big Juicy Hog here. Welcome back to the channel. Today is a huge day as the Shadowlands pre-patch has just gone live. I guess technically that was yesterday by the time you see this. Looks like we're going to have a new event, new activities, and more. I'm going to go over a couple of tips, including one for making some gold at the start of the pre-patch. Also, I've noticed that only about 3% of all people watching my videos currently are subscribed to the channel, so if you could subscribe and hit that notification button, it'd be greatly appreciated. So number one, the new barber shop is out and there's a ton of awesome new customization for your characters. This means that the common barber shops are probably going to be packed and incredibly bustling. In order to save yourself some possible lag, or even just to get a better look at your cool new body transmog, you can head to some of the less popular locations. There's one in Dalaran if you like, but the most outlying of all the barber shops are actually both in Netherstorm. There's one in Area 52, and the other is in Cosmo Wrench. If you would like your privacy while you go through this new process, head to one of those locations and have the barbershop all to yourself. Number 2. Now is the time to level. When I say level, I mean all of your characters. For two main reasons. The new leveling speed is incredibly fast compared to the old leveling process. Now it sounds like it will take between 6 and 15 hours to level to the max level with the brand new character. This leveling process should be in place going forward, but I heard that they may possibly nerf it and make it a little bit longer. Take that with a grain of salt, but it is something to keep in mind. The other reason to level to max during the pre-patch is that there is catch-up gear that should be approximately the same item level as the last raid. This will make going into Shadowlands that much easier, and you won't have to grind out tons of world quests to incrementally upgrade your gear. This is something that could potentially go away with the release of Shadowlands, so it will be worthwhile to do before this time. And now, for a little bit of a gold tip. Some of the new content for the pre-patch is going to be centered in Northrend, and specifically Ice Crown. There are going to be a bunch of new zone elites to kill, and there will likely be an incredible amount of people in the area. What does this mean for gold making? means that the prices for all of the gathering materials from Northrend content will likely be going down, down, down as people grab nodes while doing the content. This includes Titanium, Serenite, Lich Bloom, Ice Thorn, and the crystallized elements that can be found with them. So what should you do with that information? Dump it all in the auction house? Absolutely not. You should wait for the patch to be in full swing and start buying everything up at cheap prices. You can save the materials for a rainy day, or you can turn them into crafted items, of course. I should have some other information to share with you guys as I get the opportunity to actually play the new patch. I may also have a special non-gold related video coming up, if what I'm hoping for with the barber system comes to fruition. Anyways, that's going to be it for today's video. I hope that you found these couple of tips to be helpful, and I will catch you in the next video.